To national stories now. Soldiers, police personnel and vigilantes are currently tracking the abductors of no fewer than 31 train passengers who were whisked away from the Tom Ikimi train station Ugwebe, at Doe Station on Saturday. Among the victims are the manager of the station, Govin Okmi, and head of security of the station, simply identified as the Hairi, and 29 passengers. The incident is coming 10 months after the bandits attacked the Abuja Cardinal train service, killing 14 passengers and abducting 65 others. They are released after spending months in captivity and paying ransoms. Reacting Edo State Deputy Governor Comrade Philip Shaibu said the state government is not taking the incident lightly and will do all it can to ensure the release of all those abducted. <coughs> and now we are being joined by the PPR Edo State Police Command, SP Chidi Mwagbuzo, to get an update on the train attack incident in Edo State. Hello, thank you for joining us. Thank you for having me. All right, uh, thank you so much. Uh, a lot of Nigerians are curious. They want to know what the situation is at the moment. What exactly happened? Well, uh, we cannot talk about the incident without talking about uh, other things that followed. Uh, exactly on the 7th of January 2023, uh, distress call was made to the regional police officer in charge of uh, Igwebe about the attack and kidnap of passengers on a train station, Igwebe. Immediately, the regional police officer mobilized his operatives, members of a state security network, and local Richland group and hundreds to the scene. Immediately they got up there at the train stations. They spread over into the forest. And uh, immediately they were able to rescue six persons in different locations. A fairly mm -hmm. old man of mm -hmm. about 65 years a woman with a baby of about one year, a girl of six years old, okay. a girl and a boy of same parents of about five and two years, respectfully, were rescued. And uh, just yesterday on Sunday, the 8th of January 2023, the deputy governor of the state, right, Honorable Philip Shaibu, a long time with the Commissioner of Police in the state, CP Mohammed Adamu Dampara, other heads of security agencies moved into Igwebe and the uh, search operation known as Bush Combi. All right. Th now that uh, the operation has started, can you kindly confirm to us if we've been able to identify the assailants? Who exactly are they? Well, with the information available to us, to the divisional police officer, Igwebe, and the description method, known as uh, uh, oper uh, uh, operation, or a method of uh, operation, uh, shows that they are heard us. Okay. So that's, uh, we, we can take that to the bank and say they were attacked by headers. The kidnappers are actually headers. Now, these headers, I, I mean, yes. some persons are beginning to postulate and ask, uh, are we seeing a situation where there's an expansion of the network of bandits from the north down to the south? Is that what is happening? Or, I mean, what, what information or what more do we know about these headers? Shedat means that they are headsmen who raise cattle and they could be found in any part of the country. So that does not signify or indicate that they are bandits. All right. Well, thank you so much. Uh, just before we close, we'd like to have uh, maybe a, a patent shot, really, uh, something that uh, would probably soothe uh, curious Nigerians, something we need to know. 
while uh, the commissioner of police in those states had assured the good citizens of those states and Nigerians because these uh, passengers came from different parts of the country that they should remain calm that risk you of those people is on and that we must make sure that the perpetrators of this act are arrested and prosecuted. All right. Thank you so much, S. Pichid in Wambuzo. It was a pleasure speaking with you. Thank you. All right. The Nigerian Railway Corporation, NRC, has dismissed reports of the suspension of train services on the Itakwe Wari Axis following an attack by gunmen on Ekehe train station in the Ibuebre local government area of Edo State. The managing director of NRC, Fidet Okiria, told newsmen via telephone that the train services have not been suspended, contrary to reports making the rounds. He confirmed that there was an attack which the police and the NRC are currently looking into, but said the incident has not disrupted the pressions at the station. Well, it's a wrap on the news at this hour. Many thanks for watching. My name is Perpetua Fasami Peter. Do enjoy the rest of the day and bye for now. Thank you.